Hi, this is Ikaro Fehi from Spectro Audio, and I'm here to show you what's included in the producer's edition of Sonic Mayhem's Doomsday album. First off, we have a custom contact drum sample library. Here you find almost all drum samples used on Doomsday, organized in kicks, snares, hi-hats, and effects. Doomsday uses a lot of sounds created within the Eurorack universe. Part of the modular experience is that once you unplug, all the sounds are gone forever. So we decided to sample and archive some sounds for Doomsday directly from Sonic Mayhem's modular setup. What you find here are some of the bass and lead sounds created for Doomsday. All of these contact patches available in the producer's edition feature a custom UI which lets you tailor the sounds to your needs. Some of these patches also include round robins for more natural and organic sounds. First, let's take a listen to the bass patches. Here are some of the lead patches. Doomsday's producer edition also includes two unique Max for Live devices created by Spectro Audio, the Omega Sequencer and the Alpha Destroyer. Since sequencers are an important part of Doomsday's soundscape, we decided to make our own sequencer. The Omega Sequencer is fun and easy to use. First, set it to record mode, which lets you record 8 notes using any MIDI controller. Then, set it to play mode and hold any key on your MIDI controller in order to play back the sequence. When in play mode, C3 will play the original sequence, while all the other notes will play and transpose the entire sequence relative to the interval between C3 and the note you played. In other words, D3 will transpose the sequence by two semitones while C4 would transpose the sequence by 12 semitones. The Omega Sequencer also includes a very intuitive velocity sequencer and other parameters such as rate, gate length, and swing amount. Finally, the tension knob lets you easily create buildups without having to automate the internal settings of your virtual synth. Next up, you have the Alpha Destroyer our bit crusher and distortion plugin. For Doomsday, simplicity was just as important as the sound. While the Alpha Destroyer is very easy to use, it can have a massive effect on your sounds. You can choose to use it in the default mode, or expand it to a more advanced mode, which lets you control all the individual parameters. In addition to the contact library and the plugins, the producer's edition will let you get your hands on Sonic Mayhem's own custom samples created during the making of Doomsday. 
Here you find drum loops, music beds, drones, additional drum sounds, effects, and even some custom guitar riffs, which were created just for the producer's edition. All of these sounds are 44.1, 24-bit WAV files, and are ready to be used in your own production. While most of the sounds present in Doomsday are coming from analog hardware, VSTs like Native Instruments Massive and Absinthe were still used in this record. Sonic Mayhem collaborated with the well-known sound programmer, The Unfinished, to bring you 256 custom presets for Massive and Absinthe. These presets were created to follow the sonic vision of Doomsday, heavy presets that evoke memories of the early 90s industrial scene, tangerine dreamlike sequences, and big evolving pads by the likes of Vangelis. Lastly, we have all the stems of the Doomsday tracks for you. Remix them as you wish and share them online. We'll have a remix competition at some point, so make sure you share a masterpiece with us. I hope you enjoyed watching this video tour of the Doomsday Producers Edition. Thanks for watching.